Hi friends, now we start our new topic that is design of uh, earth grid with respect to touch and step voltages. IEEE standard ED2000 gives formula to calculate touch and step potential for regular earth grids. Touch voltage is defined as a potential difference between ground potential rise and surface potential at the given point where a person is standing. So when there is a fault, uh, the current will flow through the uh, earth which has a resistance and uh, the result uh, will be that uh, there will be a voltage rise because when current passes through resistance there is a voltage drop. So now there will be a difference between uh, the uh, basically touch where a person is touching and the surface. So this potential is called as a touch potential while at the same time having his hands to contact with ground structure during a fault to ensure that the earth grid design is safe the calculated touch voltage for the earth grid should be lower than the tolerable touch voltage. The step voltage is defined as the difference in surface potential experienced by a person bridging a distance of 1 meter with his feet without contacting any other grounded object during a fault. To ensure that the earth grid design is safe, the calculated step voltage for earth grid should be lower than tolerable step voltage. Considering a body resistance of 1000 ohms and resistance of 2 feet in parallel, the tolerable step and touch potentials can drive as formula uh, for a body weight of 50 kg considered in accordance with SEC uh, TSP 119.10. According to IEEE standard ED2000 equation 29 and equation 32, page 27 formula for maximum allowable step voltage and maximum allowable touch voltage for 50 kg body weight is given below respectively. So these are the two formulas that uh, you have to use to calculate step and touch potential allowable and if you remember in previous uh, uh, section we have calculated these values. So, uh, allowable touch potential uh, is coming as 662 volts maximum allowable and tolerable step voltage is coming from 2176 volts. So, now what we have done that we have put the parameters uh, in the software and we get the result which is for touch voltage magnitude. So here you can see this is our grid station layout and uh, different colors here represent different touch voltages present in the substation. So here you can see the, mag uh, the, uh, the maximum voltages are uh, blue or light blue in color so which will be less than 196.86 and 164.05 the voltages which is calculated by the software automatically. Uh, this will appear. Uh, whereas uh, the maximum uh, voltages are shown in uh, red color and which is 328 so which is uh, really uh, less than the allowable maximum allowable touch potential in the substation so in, in the substation different area there is a different uh, touch potential but the maximum touch potential is less than the tolerable touch potential so let's see uh, maximum is 328 whereas as per our calculation allowable touch potential was 626 so it means that uh, it is uh, in accordance with the limit so this is uh, showing the complete diagram of the substation and everything is under limit next uh, graph uh, we are getting is uh, for Step potential, uh, this is again the touch potential, maximum voltage it is shown as 328, maximum threshold is 661.990. So again you can see this uh, single electro touch voltage versus spherical. So in the previous section we have seen this red color which have the highest uh, number of uh, uh, voltages. Uh, touch voltages and these are somehow shown in in, in a sphere spherical form so the minimum allowable is 661 
uh, and we are getting maximum uh, at our substitution is 328 so this is basically the another way of presentation then we will see the step voltages also calculated uh, from the software so maximum mm, step voltages are shown in red color and you can find hardly it's very small spots in red color you can see if you zoom in so maximum uh, step voltages are 109.38 various allowable voltages are you can see here they are shown here are 2176 almost 2 kV so allowable is 2 kV whereas we are getting 109 which is really below the limit so this is coming from the software so we can say that this is uh, uh, is quite okay so these are the graph and calculation which is coming out from the software so we will go to our next topic now thank you very much